Welcome back divers. In this video I'm going to show you how to install your ROV's left side motors. Let's start by installing the left vertical motor. You'll need a motor with a left side propeller, a vertical motor brace, uh, two 632 nuts, and two 632 one half inch machine screws. Grab the vertical motor leads and feed them through that slot inside of the vertical motor holder. As you pull the leads through, uh, push the vertical motor until it's flush inside of the motor mount. Next, we'll have to hold the motor in place with the vertical motor brace. Take your brace and slide it between the end of the motor housing and the propeller. Then slide it downwards until it's flush against the base of the motor. Check that the holes on the brace line up with the holes on the left side rail. Now thread a 632 machine screw through the brace and into the left side rail. Then grab another machine screw and repeat the process for the remaining hole on your motor brace. Once the screws are in place, tighten each one uh, from the inside of the left rail with a 632 nut. Now it's time to install the left horizontal motor. We'll need another left side motor, two more 632 half inch screws, uh, two more 632 nuts, and a left horizontal motor brace. So just like we did on the vertical motor, we'll take these leads and feed them through the slot on the inside of the motor holder. Pull the wires through and push the motor until it's flush inside the horizontal motor holder. Then take your left horizontal brace and place it flush against the motor and the left rail. Grab your 632 machine screws and thread them into place. From the inside of the left rail, tighten up the screws using 632 nuts. If you don't feel like hand tight quite does the job, you can tighten them a little bit further with a screwdriver. Nice work. Your left side motors are now installed, and next we'll do the right side motors.